<laughs> so Friday night. Yeah. Besides oh, doing a live performance for the record company, isn't it attached to some other it, reason also? Oh, yeah. Well, that's, I want us to say that yes. a couple things. I yeah, know yeah. what you're getting to. Go ahead. One is being filmed. That's why I'm doing it. We're filming it for a, a future, um, uh, you know, broadcast. You know, when the album comes out. So that's why I'm doing this show. Um, secondly, you know, prepare yourself. I mean, l let me just say, Twisted Sister. It will always be the proudest moment of my life. Hard fought with with brothers in arms. I mean, we we you know we made a statement and 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 I will always be proud of it at the same time I am trying to you know as I went solo trying to create a solo body of work that represents me I mean it's the idea of being solo I think you know if you're gonna just play Twisted Sister songs well then why don't you play with Twisted Sister so you know be forewarned that most of my set is D. Snyder material, you know. I mean, I've got five well, it should albums now, yeah. and, I, and, I, and 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 so, and a lot were misfires. Uh, but um, <laughs> but now I'm starting to have songs that people are starting to identify with me, and, and you know, so uh, so expect to be hearing, um, you know, a lot of my stuff on that show. But what Mark's alluding to is Melissa's wish. Yes. Right? Yes. A charitable charitable cause that we've both been involved with since its inception. Melissa's Wish is a very, very interesting charity yeah. because we actually knew, knew Melissa. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And Melissa, we wow. rode with Melissa yes. on charity rides, mm -hmm. and we know her mother and her father, and they work with us on March of Dimes rides for mm -hmm. years. And then she got cancer and passed, and her parents started... A, a charity in her memory called Melissa's Wish, because Melissa, and I, I'm getting chills. I always get chills with this story because it's people, you know, on their, from, it, when she was dying, she told her parents that if you do anything in my memory, do it for the families who uh, the caregivers. Yeah, the she caregivers, has, and that was a big thing. She said that to me. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it, she was. She fought a hard battle. I mean, she really. Uh, for for quite a few years, kicked cancer's ass. Yes, you know uh, until it got the best of her. And uh, she was in her twenties. She's a young woman. I think it was thirty two. Thirty two. Okay. Passed, yeah. yeah. A few. Well, quite everybody a few seems years like ago. they're in twenties to me. Yeah. 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 <laughs> everybody seems like they're teenagers to me. But uh, Melissa, uh, Melissa Blackford, um, put up a huge fight and made it known that uh, she didn't want anybody to feel sorry for her. You know, and her parents followed uh, her wishes and started. Um, uh, Melissa's wish, and it's all about taking care of the people that do the caregiving, uh, not only family members but uh, 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 you know nurses and things like that that are always there day in and day out. And these people need a break from caring for someone because it wears you down. Um, you know, I had to do it with my mom and other relatives and, and my father and everybody out there could tell stories of being a caregiver and making things happen. And that's what Melissa's Wish is all about. So you, you, the, the, the charity will take care of, will help you maybe pay bills, maybe get medical uh, supplies, maybe just, even if it's spiritually, well, sometimes this, people and, need that. And this is what Melissa witnessed, you know, from, I mean, she was in hospitals and she witnessed is that, you know, after the people pass, the, the, the residual effect of that passing, Tremendous. emotional and financial, when you, have, when you have family members who are ill for a long time, people, some people wind up you know, selling their homes or, or, or refinancing or having to quit their jobs or they spent so much money and now they're left, they've lost this loved one and, they're left, and then they're left with the medical bills and all the responsibilities oh, yeah. that go it's with still it. There. So it's something I never even thought about. Yeah. And to, it'll, you know, it takes someone on their deathbed to see the plight of others and and when and Bill, who was working with us, was on the committee for uh, for well, first it was for um, uh, March of Dimes, March of Dimes. Then it was for the Harry Chapin uh, right, for Long Island Cares, Long Island Harry Cares. Food Bank. Yes. And when he said, "Listen, I've got to go and do this charity for my my uh, daughter," I said, "Why don't we do that charity for your daughter?" And we asked the committee, and everybody unanimously. We all knew Melissa, and it was like, "Yeah, this is a good cause." Nobody ever thinks about the caregivers. 
you know, and, and they're the ones who are left with the biggest burden when the loss of the family member and the economic burden as well. So, yes. so, so there's a charity part of this event on this weekend. So on Friday, I should say as well, for Melissa's wish. Yeah, it's uh, it has been um, uh, for the charity. You know, the the D Snyder's uh, motorcycle run has been a, a a big successful thing going on every year. And because of COVID, we didn't do it last year. We last two it. years, the yeah, last two yeah. years, we couldn't do it. But it was certainly the biggest motor motorcycle event in the metro area. Yeah, without a doubt, it was. And, and we uh, did that for 17 years. Yeah, we did. And Mark and I, you I know, post this up there. I saw it up there. I saw it up there. Yes. And you know, and and. And what I, Mark and I, you know, we, we were best friends. Mark was the best man at my wedding. And, you know, we unfortunately had a falling out when I became a total asshole during Twisted Sister, and I do take full credit. Um, Is it credit you want for that? Responsibility. <laughs> I take responsibility. <laughs> and when we try to fix, heal that relationship, the first thing we did together was charity rides. Mm -hmm. Uh, Mark, from the first charity ride I did up in Connecticut, and all the rides I've done, uh, Mark has always been there with me, riding with me, on the committees with me, yeah. and that's what brought us together as people. Mm -hmm. uh, the band was secondary, really. I, it, at I, that point, it was secondary, because when we first started doing this, there was no band. I, I remember, we. I yeah, mean, there was, was a moment, I don't want to rehash it. bad times, but we had, we had to did something for VH1 or something, and, we, and then we had a big blow up in, in the studio, and and I said, you know, Mark, I said, you want to talk about this? He goes, no, I'm not going back there. He said, I'll ride with you. And I said, I'll play with you, but I don't want to fucking go back over the past. And I got that. And I said, fair enough. And first things we did was charity rides together. And yeah, then Twisted yeah. started, as Twisted, to our credit, charity shows. Right. New York Steel, playing for the troops over in Korea. USO tour. USO. Korea, yes. I mean, we, we did, it was all, and that brought us back together, doing charity work. Oh, yeah, yeah, without a doubt. The charity stuff was the first thing that we uh, we really socialized with. Yep. You know, uh, getting all that stuff done and all the meetings and business. So. Um, so it's great um, that you're still supporting the Melissa's Wish, uh, the, whole, the whole thing, the charity, everything like that. Yeah, they wanted to tie some charity, and unfortunately, we couldn't haven't done rides for no. two years now. So I said, well, let's do Melissa's Wish, and, and yeah. that was I'm really glad to to, to give something. Yeah, it's to good. That. Uh, that's a yeah. great cause. It really is a great cause. Anybody who wants to donate to it, just look it up, man, and and donate to the cause. It's an amazing cause. It all goes to great, great stuff, and it's going to be. Up on our chat there, if anybody wants to uh, help out that cause. Yeah, Melissa's uh, wish helping caregivers. Nobody ever considers their plight, and yes. certainly <laughs> they they really have a lot to deal with. Major burden. Tremendous, tremendous, tremendous burden. We got right? serious. You got to get serious once in a while. Once people. in a while, all right. Then we, you okay. know, <laughs> I hate sounding here. Sound like we're doing a, a telethon. Yeah. You know, the yeah. phones are ringing. Yes. <laughs> all right. Now comedy jokes. Yeah, no, the comedy, the comedy <laughs> stuff. The. Uh, the history here uh, between us, uh, you know, if there's